What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. First off, I want to say I'm sorry I haven't posted for about a week, so I do apologize for that. It's been really, really cold outside, like 30. It snowed two days ago, and now it's 65 degrees, so I thought I'd pick up the camera and get out and try to film something while it's still warm. But before I actually start the, the video out, um, I just want to go and tell you guys, merch link in the bio. Um, there is merch out there now. This is called a gra or graphite gray. It's the best, I don't know, like uh, it's like the softest material. It's 80% cotton, 20% polyester. If you guys are wanting something really, really comfortable, definitely check out the, the website. This is the back, you guys can see it. <laughs> this is more for like, for like me, so like my brand and stuff. So like you don't have to put that on there, but you can actually like, I don't know, change this up a little bit. You can move it to another spot, make it real big. Check out, just check out the website. Um, uh, there's other stuff on there than just this. So if you guys are into cars, check it out. There's really, really cool stuff. So merch link in the description. I asked you guys to uh, send me some questions in one of my Instagram posts at Random Rides, and uh, if you guys sent me questions, I'm gonna try to answer your guys' questions the best that I can. So I'm gonna go over Vince's real quick and do that. Um, so let's get going. Dirty as hell. I saw it on the highway. It was filthy as fuck. Yeah. What's up? What's going on? I know. It's fucking really, really, really dirty. That little bird poop on the head. I know. It's circular. I seen that it's today. Like a perfect circle. It is. It's a perfect circle. <laughs> yeah. It's, still have those wheels on it. It's disgusting. Yeah. Yeah. You can see it over here, and. And the sunlight really shows <laughs> how dirty it is. Oh yeah. I've been neglecting wow. it. Oh, it's been so fucking cold. Right. You know. Yeah. It still looks good, like, right here. No. Oh, yeah, a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Alrighty, guys. Just got over here to Vince's. Um, like I said, this is just going to be like a Q&A. So I'm, gonna, I'm just wanting to uh, post my car up somewhere and read, read some questions and stuff. That's pretty much all this video is going to be. But um, I think last weekend, no, it was two weekends ago, me and Vince went out and... Something, do you want to explain like what happened? Like what exactly happened like while you were, um, while you were driving? That's what's weird, yeah, because I wouldn't even race one We were just driving and it just started making like a, not a grinding sound, like a, a woo, 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 woo sound. That's what it sounded like. And then as the night progressed, it got worse and worse and worse. And, and it started clunking? Clunking bad. Yeah. Yeah, so I had to stop driving. Yeah, it sucks. So Mary's down for the count. For now. For now. I sell it. I sell it. Selling it. Yeah. 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 Moving on to bigger and better things. I don't know about that, but <laughs> moving on. <laughs> moving on. <laughs> I mean, you have the you've had the car for how long? Almost six years. Six years. Yeah. You've had your time. It'd be nice to keep it though. It I would. Kept it forever, like my dad kept it. Right. It would. Yeah. Oh well. Um, also, another thing that I was wanting to tell you guys, um, I've had people comment on uh, when I did the, the diffuser. Yeah. How the exhaust is cut out. Same about it melting. Yeah, they think it's going to melt. Yeah, okay, it's been two weeks since I've installed that thing. And I'll show you. You can even see it. No, oh, you can't. It's not melting at all. No. At all. No. Good. I mean, you also got to think that the exhaust. I'll show you this side too. 
It looks nice because it's sitting like flush right up in it. But um, the exhaust is stainless steel too. And like from, I guess, the after the header is back, down pipes and back. Right. Um, there, it's stainless steel all the way there, all the way to the tips. So stainless steel extracts heat very, very well. So by the time it actually hits the tips, the tips are already cold. So yeah. But yeah, guys, I just want to go and show you guys that. I'm going to post up the, the car, um, I don't know, somewhere else and uh, just read read some comments or questions that you guys are asking and hopefully I can answer them the best that I can. That's all this video is going to be. So um, Vince is going to go in here and eat. He's got some McDonald's. Yeah. So um, yeah. he's going to go and eat and then we'll come back out here and do that. Alrighty guys, uh, go cop this merch real quick too. Uh, Vince just designed this. Yeah, it's a Hyundai. Um, the This is going to be on the back of the t-shirt. This is going to be in uh, on the website. Link is, link is in the description. Uh, the RR, that's something that you actually have to click on the uh, create and like choose the design in like the far left corner of the website and then drag that over if you actually like, want that on there. But it looks really, really cool like that. But if you're the Hyundai owner, yeah, it's a Hyundai because people don't think the back of it looks like a Hyundai, but it is. So I thought that was pretty cool. So shout out to Vince. Um, where he's also designed some other stuff. Um, that's not on the website yet, but it's going to be on there soon. So if you're into Evos, STIs, GTRs, SRT8, and the Corvette, um, these designs are going to be on there soon also, but we just still got to upload them. So get ready for those. Alrighty guys, finally, I'm finally set up to uh, read these questions. I posted this picture on Instagram, if it'll focus, there you go, um, at Random Rides. Uh, a couple weeks ago and I said time for a Q&A and I asked you guys just to leave your guys' questions no matter what you guys wanted to ask you guys can ask them and uh, I'm gonna do my best to answer you guys' questions so that's what I'm gonna do today um, the very first question that I got was from Josh Joshipoo0621 please answer this one has there been any major issues with the 3.8 motor or anything at all reliable reliability wise uh, no, no, there hasn't been any problems at all. Uh, yeah, there, there hasn't. Not, not with mine, at least. Uh, have you considered sending your tail lights to fly ride? I've actually thought about it, but I don't have other tail lights to put in my car because I daily drive my car, so I don't have other tail lights to put in my car to send them to California and then have them do it. So I think if I'm gonna actually. Uh, redo my my tail lights I'm gonna take them apart and do them myself so I, I would like to do that maybe sometime this winter I am T L I I underscore oh when are you coming to Palm Springs like the other car vloggers <coughs> uh, honestly I don't know uh, probably never probably never just to be completely honest with you drift underscore drive underscore die do you like the Audi mod yes um, if I take apart my tail lights I'm going to be doing the Audi tail mod, uh, the Audi tail light mod also. Um, if you don't know what that is, just Google Audi tail light mod for the Genesis Coupe and uh, you guys will see what it looks like. It looks, it's really, really cool. Brendan underscore Phyllis, would you ever put on a big wing, big wang? No, no, I wouldn't. Uh, I'm not a big fan of big wings. Um, if if you do it right and do like a chassis mount, I think those look okay. Maybe on like a BRZ FRS um, 86, some of those look okay, but I'm not a big fan of big wings. I'm just, it just seems really ricer to me. Brendan Stansberry, I'll post this up just because I don't want to read all of it, but I have read this one before and pretty much what he's asking um, would I like to be the person that keeps the Genesis Coupe and be the person known as the Genesis Coupe and build it to be like, I'm the guy that has the badass, really fast Genesis Coupe. Or do I plan on selling it and getting my dream car, which is an STI? Um, it's kind of up in the air. I think it would be cool to have a really, really, really fast Genesis Coupe. But then again, there's not a big following on YouTube for where I'm actually trying to grow my channel on the Genesis so I think I would save my money and put it into an STI 
because an STI is actually what I would like to like to have. So yeah, I would sell my car and get an STI. So. David Tolman one, how much do you spend on gas each, each month? Uh, I'd probably say 140 bucks, 150 bucks, roughly. Muscle underscore memory 89, so that's Vince. He asked, why haven't you boosted your Jenny yet? Um, actually, Vince, you already know this, and it's it's money. It is. Um, I I'm I don't have eighty five hundred dollars for the kit, and then if I would install it, I guess that'd be free. But I wouldn't install it. I'd probably take it to uh, BTR and have them install it and then tune it and get it all ready for me. <laughs> and my car would be down for a week or two. And this is my daily driver, so I'd have to pay to get a rental car so yeah it's, it's money so that that's why I haven't boosted my car yet guys um, I know that this this video is titled why haven't you boosted your boot why haven't I boosted my Genesis coupe and I can't really elaborate it any more than that it's it's money it really is because a lot of you guys want me to boost it I would love to boost my car um, hopefully I can get sponsored or something like that and somebody would sponsor me and help me out and get me a turbo kit but if that doesn't happen I probably will never boost my car nitrous is probably a big possibility but boosting my car is is very very unlikely just because of the money I don't want to go and put you know 10 grand into my car and still want to get rid of it for an STI you know that's that's where I'm at kind of because I, I want an STI I really do gapster one 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 six one nine nine four it's a hell of a name <laughs> what site do you buy your car parts from uh, honestly I'd probably say 90% of my parts come from Amazon they really do um, but there are a few other ones like arc uh, arc.com arc performance uh, that's my my down pipes and my test pipes were from arc um, my wheels from esrwheels.com um, my tires though, they were from Amazon. Uh, did I get anything else from any? I think everything else I've got from Amazon, guys. Sam Squatch 69, get a tune, question mark. That, you kind of, that's not really a question, but it is like, have I got a tune, I guess, is kind of what you're asking, no. Um, but I, I need to, yeah. Braun, Don, Don arrived. Ron drawn or ride. I don't know. I'm sorry. I didn't pronounce that right. All right. Are you going to store your Genesis this winter? Uh, no, I'm not. I'm I'm driving my car. It's a daily driver. I drive my car in the winter. I've been, I've owned the car twi or two for two years and I drove them in both winters and it actually doesn't do too bad as long as you keep your foot out of it. So yeah, if you ever think that you can't get a rear wheel drive car because you have bad winters, depending on the winters, I guess if you live in like New York, um, that would kind of suck because sometimes they get like three, four, five feet. Um, but my, I live in Indiana, so you know we we might get a few inches here and there, um, eight inches at max. But yeah, I, I drive my car in the winter, so no, I'm not storing it. Big underscore B nine one one. Are you ever gonna change the color of the Jenny? <laughs> I've got that a lot. Uh, no, <laughs> I I love. The, I think it's called a uh, it's Sakuba red. I love the red. I, I, it pops. Um, I mean, it's just the typical sports car color is red. So no, I I'm not changing the color. I'm never gonna wrap it. Um, if I did wrap it though, it'd be something like super super crazy, and then I would probably take it off, you know, a month later. But the amount of money that you spend on wraps, I it's not really worth it. I like the red too much. So yeah. Um, guys, that, that's all the, the questions that I have. If you guys have any more questions that I didn't answer, um, leave them in the comments below. If you guys like the video, I know it's already like probably 12 minutes long or longer. Um, if I didn't answer your guys' questions, so leave them in the comments. Make sure also go get your merch. Link to that is in the description below also. Uh, if you don't want to look in the description, it's, uh, it's uh, shop.spreadshirt.com forward slash random rides uh, go check it out there's a lot of really cool stuff on there we're still adding more stuff if you're a car guy 
Uh, you, I think you guys will like the site. You can organize your own stuff, customize your own shirts. Uh, if I would say anything, get the graphite gray t-shirt. It's the softest, but I mean, you can pick whatever color you want, whatever size you want, so yeah. If you guys like the video, man, hit that thumbs up button. If you guys haven't already, subscribe to my channel. I know this is just a Q&A, so hopefully you guys liked it. Till next time, guys, keep it random. Peace.